Okay, so I wanted to show you how to make a different Padlet. I've showed a stream in a different video. You can view that on my channel. So this time I'm going to make a wall Padlet. So first thing I'm going to do is click make a Padlet. And then this time I'm picking the wall. So really, I don't use the wall so much for content, more for student engagement. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this to maybe something fun. So we do a lot of competitions in my class. Um, so you could add the icon. I like to use the emojis. You can add whatever you want. Maybe this time I'll add, we typically do animals at some point. So I'll add the animals. You'll see that my puppy dog shows up here. I can change the wallpaper. If you don't like this wallpaper, you can add a different one. You've got all kinds of options here. So maybe this time we'll go with the windmill. All right, so from here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come down and there's a few things, reactions. I want them to be able to like post for this because this is gonna be one of our competitions. And then it doesn't need to require approval. I'm going to filter profanity and then I'm not going to turn on the author name because this is a competition. Now, if this wasn't a competition, then I would leave the author name on. So from here, I go up and click next, start posting. Okay. So from here it's blank. So I could add the plus sign. I could add whatever I wanted. So here I'm just going to give directions. Okay, so I'm going to tell them to post a picture of their favorite animal. So you might be thinking, but wait, some kids don't have animals. That's fine. So this is where you explain to your students. Like I last year, I had some students draw their favorite animal. Some found pictures of their favorite animal online. Um, so it doesn't have to be an animal they physically have. So from here, once I have this, I'm going to click share. And then I'm going to copy the clipboard and I typically put it in the Zoom chat because we're virtual. Um, if you're in person, you could send it out through Google Slides. So what are my students able to do? So what we do is our September competition is favorite animal. And the kids just go in and they can heart other kids' animals. So I give them a day or two to put a picture of their favorite animal on the screen. And then we'll go back and as a warm up, they'll just go in and they'll put a heart on all the ones they like. So they can put more than one, the one with the most hearts. Um, is the winner. And I don't typically give out a big prize. It might be like a sticker that's a scratch and sniff where it smells, it's scented. Um, occasionally it might be like a piece of candy. So this is not something that's big. It's just something so you can get to know your students.